For a long while now, Sarasota, Florida has been struggling with this issue of homelessness as more and more people have been finding their way on the streets and more and more people are being seen in the downtown area. It's uh, more married couples, uh, families, mothers with kids. So it's hitting, it's hitting everybody pretty hard. Realizing that this problem has reached a fever pitch, the people of Sarasota got together a few years ago and started drafting the Step Up plan to end homelessness in Sarasota County in 10 years. Other communities have either done this through government or through consultants that they've paid a great deal of money to. We did this solely as a volunteer effort. We did partner with Sarasota County. They provided staff. They provided some financial assistance. But really, this came from the uh, more than 600 people of the Sarasota community who worked together on the plan. Um, now we got to take it up to the top, and we'll see how that road goes. But I think starting in the grassroots is really important. And I think, frankly, taking it to the top with the story behind us of the, how grassroots uh, the uh, development of the plan was, that um, I think it should pave the way um, to adoption at the you know, highest levels of the community and the government. The Step Up plan was presented to city and county governments but wasn't really accepted with open arms. Well, I, I think we brought an ambitious plan to the commission, as we've been saying, and um, um, you know, they're a tough crowd, as they should be. Um, they're using our dollars wisely, and um, they're very smart. This, this plan's gonna move forward. It's not gonna just... I thought it was a great start. Um, we had tremendous community support again. I think that support helped influence the commission, and I feel like We've got the foundation to move forward. Government will be there if everyone else is there. We're there for you, and we want to see everyone else there for you. And that's really what we're, um, you know, uh, telling too. I mean, we know that it's not a government job. We know it's a private job. We know it's a business, a small business's job, and we know it's a community job. And we know it's plumbing contractor who can help see the toilet, you know, the builder and the banker. I mean, it's everyone out there and we keep saying that over and over again. Because there wasn't a lot of excitement coming from government about the Step Up plan, everybody kind of fell into a valley after it was over. However, we're only three years into this 10-year plan and since then we've had Dr. Robert Marbit come in and give us his 12-step plan to end homelessness as well. Dr. Robert Marbit, if you haven't heard, perhaps you've been living under a rock in Sarasota somewhere, uh, he has been here uh, for about the last year, I think, and done a, a census of Sarasota's homeless situation. He has kind of worked through all of our organizations that are working toward this and seen some of the, the seams uh, that, that, that we have and the, the leaks that we have. And so he's put together a really amazing proposal on things that we can do in our community to help um, succeed this problem and, and move on. We need to re sort of calibrate and restructure how we do as a community our services, both agency centric services and individual and need to move it into a engaging environment. The vision that the people of Sarasota County put forward in this step up plan was all validated by Dr. Robert Marbit's plan. We can see that in Sarasota we have a vision, we have a goal to end homelessness, and we shouldn't stop now. It's a great community, and, and the, the, the spirit of this community is amazing. And uh, that's also part of the problem, mm -hmm. uh, real honestly, because the this is a community that cares so much about people, it becomes to the point of enabling rather than that let's get smart about what we do. We, we still want to help people. We absolutely want to help people, but you have to do it in a smart way. It's my intention to this documentary series to show what Sarasota is doing to end homelessness because steps are in action, things that people don't even know about. And if we can start to communicate what is actually happening and where we go from here, perhaps we can get more community input, community investment, and we can solve this problem here. I would just say community conversation about this will take as long as it takes until we can build the consensus. If we can utilize this transmedia storytelling and tell the story through video to show how things are being done, how we are making advances in ending homelessness, then we can not only end homelessness in Sarasota, we can end homelessness throughout the world.